everybody, it's Lizzie Iverson sitting next to Ross Hecox. We're going to talk today about the June issue. Ross, what are some things that folks can look forward to? Well, we got a lot of variety in this issue. There's a, a good training article with Nevada horseman Frank Dominguez. There's also an article about our newest Western Horseman Award winner. His name's Buck Taylor. Y'all are familiar with him. He's a great artist, but also a great actor. Yep. Uh, on top of that, it's summertime. And uh, we'll be in rodeo. We have quite a bit of rodeo stories in here. One includes an article with a rodeo photographer named Mallory Beinborn. She's got the cover photo as well. Yep. And there's also a story about the cowgirls that compete in Women's Ranch Rodeo. I think you know a little bit about that. Yes, I was lucky enough to be there while Jennifer Dennison, who wrote the article, was shooting the photographs. And we did that at Art of the Cowgirl in Arizona a couple months ago. The photographs are just a great representation of how neat these real cowgirls are that were competing there at Art of the Cowgirl. So lots to look forward to in this issue. If you want to buy a single issue, click the link in this post or visit Western Horsemen to subscribe. And as we wrap this up, we're going to give you a little spoiler alert. For the August issue, Ross, what are we going to be seeing? We are talking about the Four Sixes Ranch. Okay, and that's where we are. This is the porch we're sitting on. So look forward to the August issue and stay tuned on our Facebook page for some of the photographs, videos that we've gotten on this trip so far. See you, everybody. See you.